Hi everyone, this is um, an iPhone 4G and it has been jailbroken, so you know, you've got this little folder here, so you know it has got the latest software and all that shit. Right, in this video, I'm going to show you how to get installed this. So, you go to Cydia, which you will get when you jailbroken it, you open it up, okay? Let Cydia do all its shit. Now, on, this is actually recorded on iPhone 3GS. And on 3GS it does take quite a while to open up, but it doesn't on this, right? Now to get installers, you're going to have to go on Manage first. Sources. And then you have to Edit and Add. And you want to, I'm just going to copy and paste this, but just so you can read it. There. Cydia.haculo.us Okay, I'll just leave it like that for a bit. And you want to click on Add Source. It will verify the URL, and you want to click Add anyway. It's quite quick on the 4G, which is pretty lucky. Just let it reload it there, and return to Cydia. Right, now you click on Done, and then you should have this here, Enter by User. Because we put we put in this address here, okay. Now you want to click on it, so you got Hackulus. Then you will see the app sync for all these different ones: 4.1, 4.2, 4.0, all the way back to 3.1. You want to scroll down till you get to install us. You want to cl click on install us. Then you want to go up to the top right and click install. Confirm. Now it is only 2.4 megabytes, which should be fine. Well, unless of course, like you've got so so meant much music and shit that obviously you need more. I'll we'll let it reload, and then click on Return to Cydia. So I think now you have installers. Yes, here we go. Here's installers. Now this is actually one of the best things on the whole of Cydia, I believe, because you can quite literally get any app on the whole of the app store for free some take a bit longer than others to download but that's your choice if but then because you've got the full the full iphone 4 you can just multitask on you can just go between them all as you can see you can just go between apps so it's not like on the 3g when you if you if you edited Cydia, you'd have to re i mean if you edited install it you'd have to redo it now right now i want tom tom so i'm going to type in tom tom I might as well just show you how installers works actually. Alright now we want the USA. So you click on the USA. Now as you can see, it looks just like it does on the app store. Yeah. And you get all the pictures at the bottom. Now if you were gonna buy this on the app store, it would cost you, as you can see, forty nine ninety nine, fifty dollars. But we're not gonna pay that. We're gonna click on download. It doesn't say buy it now, it just because download. And here, these are the two sources you can get it from. Hotfire.com and Mediafire.com. It doesn't say who it's crap by. If you want it, you can go on the launch app store, but we're going to go on Hotfire.com. Right, now, regular download and high speed download. If you've, if you've got an account, you might as well go on high speed, but I don't. So you go on regular download. Now, the only problem with this is it takes, yeah, about 15 seconds. Which, if you're too impatient... Too bad, but otherwise it's fine. And you click here to download. Started as you can see. You go to the download section and you will see it download. Now this is gonna take a long time, you see an hour. But I believe as you already have the iPhone 4, you should just be able to go to settings if you want to just switch between the two we'll go back to installers and it's still downloading beautiful so that's how you get installers on Cydia and that's also how you download apps